from the Manchester Boston Regional Airport. Please push the button on the left for a ticket. I mean, you're talking, I mean, I, I don't know the numbers, but it's got to be hundreds of thousands. There's, there's no way this can be extended there, so why do they extend it here? It's, it doesn't make sense. The spokesperson or somebody from the group? Uh... It's like herding cats. <laughs> yeah, like herding cats. What is your concern with the uh, enhanced security? My concern, I'm, I'm a business traveler, and right now I'm in line for a job that will require that I travel to Chicago, Pittsburgh, and New York. And that means on a routine basis, I either have a choice between being subjected to uh, constant irradiation from the machines or effectively being groped on a daily basis when I travel. Thank you very much. Happy thanks. All right. How about oh, you? Hi. <laughs> What's your concern? Um, there's a couple of s severe concerns I have. Um, the radiation is a big concern for me. And my personal violation of a rope down is another concern. Um, there's, if this kind of behavior was done to me outside of this scenario, I would be filing um, some kind of criminal charge against the person that would do that. So I, it wouldn't be something I would opt for, but there, there's no way I'm going to opt to be radiated on a regular basis because of uh, security that someone seems to think is necessary. I traveled so extensively on the ground in New York, I did subways, I did trains, that there was no kind of infringement in that way there, and I don't see why it's necessary here. You know, the terrorists are very satisfied with what they think they're doing. I would expect a heck of a lot more people coming in flying than we've really seen. It's effectively empty out here on the, what's supposed to be the busiest travel day of the year. And we do have Boston Airport not too far away from Manchester, but I'd still expect to see some people out here. 